Come on, make it 60. 60, 60, 57. Come on, 61. I guess I'm a might. Welcome back to Tropico 6. Welcome back. El press. So, the last time you have been watching the Tropico episode, you know that we have advanced to the World Wars. And uh, so basically, this is like the first war uh, era. Uh, well, the Alliance was fi fighting with the Axis, I think, something like that. Uh, the thing is, our situation is a uh, fucked. If you have been watching the previous episode, you know that basically we've set up like the... Let's call it the living space of, of our town. But we advanced way too early to the next age and now I'm kinda... I'm, uh, I will have problems with money, okay? Let's put it this way. I'm gonna have like serious problems with money. And also apparently the thing that we have neglected in the previous episode, which is... Uh, if I could only find it... There it is. The fertility of the land. Now it's hitting our plantation. So, for example, the first one we have built, at the moment, is running on minus 40% of fertility. So, that's like bad. That's like super, super really bad. And it's only gonna get worse. So, now the question is, can I demolish this thing and actually like count that this thing will fix itself? I don't know. This is the first thing we need to do. Uh, we need to basically get like money like Serious money, so yeah It's gonna be problematic like a lot fatality as well. Okay. Well Okay, uh, this is gonna be this is gonna be bad It's gonna be really 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 bad. So yeah, I can only hope for the best I think Okay, the other thing is that I increased the wages around and I think this is gonna be bad as well because we are not making any money, so I'm gonna like go back the medium one and hope for the best. Right, so anything else? Remember the story of the man who built his house on yeah. the foundation of sand. We need to build a log wait what? <laughs> the church from an overseas state. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Says, Please don't leave again. Hold on a minute. Uh the wait 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 wait. The church wants me to build a logging camp. Okay. <laughs> that's that's fine with me. I don't mind. Okay, the farms are destroyed. So now, please, by the Lord of God, hope that this thing will work. So we need sugar. We need like a lot of sugar. So one goes over here. Uh, next to it, we have to build something else because there's like this one work mode that I hope it actually is gonna work. So maybe tobacco, no, coffee, no, cotton. Okay, cotton, we can build cotton next to it. So let's build cotton. Now on the opposite side, what I could try to build on the opposite side? Maybe rubber. Okay, that doesn't sound bad. This thing is gonna squeeze in. Oh, shit. No, you're not gonna squeeze totality in. Fudge. Okay, change of plans. Cancel construction, cancel construction. Uh, wreck the road as well. I have very limited amount of money. This is bad. This is really, really, honestly, like, super bad. I did not expect that things would go so bad. I was expecting them to go bad, but not this bad. So, I'm probably the one who's supposed to be get blamed. Well, I am the one who screwed up, so you, you get the idea. Uh, okay, sugar's there. Cocoa, tobacco, coffee, cotton, 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 cotton. We need cotton. Okay, we got cotton. What else we could try to get? Rubber. Let's get rubber over here. Okay, I'm on gonna go bankrupt very soon as well, so that's just wonderful. Uh, I think we don't have cocoa. Right, let's just get those built at first, and then we're gonna see what else we could try to get. And speaking of getting built, I also need to not this thing. I need to destroy this road and fix the other road remaining. A little tiny bit. Okay, but this won't work. Come on, work with me, game. There we go. Nice! Ooh, why the hell I had to screw it up so badly? I don't know. I don't know. I just I just decided to screw it, you know. Like for fun. For fun and lose. Okay. Right, the fighter has arrived. So he got a little bit of money for us, but this is this is not gonna help a lot. Why? Because all of the plantations are currently getting developed once again. Let's see. Fertility of the land. Okay. Nothing over here. So that means that the fertility have changed. Thankfully. Uh, ranch. No. Uh, what we are making here? What we are growing here? Sugar. Okay. Cotton. 
and rubber. Sugar, cotton and rubber. Yeah. So tobacco, not gonna work. Coffee, not gonna work. Corn, but I could try to get bananas and maybe pineapples. But let's get these bananas. I have to just wreck the road. This is the thing that remains of the road, so let's get this thing out. I need to build some farms up here as well. Uh, okay, so this is only to fix up the uh, the current destroyed economy of Tropico. It actually feels like fixing Cuba again, you know? <laughs> cocoa. I had sugar, cocoa and rubber, I think? Did I? Rubber, cotton, sugar. Wait, what? Rubber, cotton, sugar. Okay. Rubber, cotton, sugar. Let's get some cocoa. Cocoa! Let's get some cocoa. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna build you... Well, technically, I could try to build it next to this thing. So, I could try to save a little bit on the production. Unless you're gonna allow me to get... Yeah, tobacco is not gonna work. Ah, this is bad. Later on, as the game will progress, we need to find like a better place to set up the farms. Like, really, really good spot to set up the farms. Plantation, corn, please, because we're gonna... Uh, go run to food very soon. So that's like a thing. Okay. Can I please build uh, Tobacco on the on the hill. Yes, I can the lightful. So if one's gonna go over here That's nice. Wreck the remainings of the road, which is this thing. Wreck it So we're gonna fix the highway as well actually. Actually, I can do this thing right away. Right, so that's one thing uh, We have here tobacco. Tobacco is gonna work. Tobacco, 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 not that thing. Tobacco, tobacco, tobacco. I am pressing the wrong buttons. Sugar. Okay, coca. Coffee. Okay, coffee is gonna work. Coffee over here. I need to place somewhere the tobacco again, I think. No, we need sugar. Okay, that's actually worked for me. So sugar can go over here. Next to it can go tobacco. Yeah! Okay, just make it nice. There you go. Okay, so with the remaining money, we have to... We need to get able to pay it, to pay the, the citizens. And after that, no idea. He okay, demolished this one. And we need to build a new logging camp somewhere around. So the church will be happy at this little tiny bit. Uh, what I could try to build you... I think I can build you over here. Yeah, let's build you over here. However... We're gonna set you this thing. I cannot set it yet. Okay. But that's that should be fine. That should be fine. That should be fine. That should be okay though. Okay. Now, speaking of trade, what we could try to trade. I'm selling leather, sugar, and tobacco at the moment. Which is nice. And I can try to import different stuff. Okay. The Americans are buying cigars, but I'm not making any at the moment, I believe. No, this is yeah, this is export cigars. So last time I said that we need to do something to get the weapon production up and ready. Uh, because if you're gonna go to the research thing, you will notice that, if I'm gonna find it... There you go, resources, show all. So we have nickel over here, we have coal over here, we have iron over here. And apparently coal and iron has spawned in the neighborhood, which is terrible. So the idea is that... Oh, we have gold. Oh my god, we have so much gold over here. Really? Huh. Okay, that's interesting. The idea is that um, I need to... S I probably... I'm gonna fire mine this thing out. And after the next era is gonna start, we're gonna get on this land and we're gonna build like a new neighborhood over here. So, for now this is gonna be my money making, money making center. And after that, we will have to move this thing here. I'm so, so glad yeah. I made this deal with you, Presidente. Uh, I made a deal with you? The broker. Oh yeah, I ordered him to sell planks. I mean, he wanted me to sell planks and he paid me now for the Swedish account. If you don't know, this is the thing. El Presidente is aware that one day he will have to retire from his position as the El Presidente. So he is gathering money on his Swedish account. The thing is, that's only like for modification of the score in the end game. At least for me, because I actually prefer to focus on the glory of Tropico than like worrying about my Swiss account, but that's like a thing. You, you get the idea. Technically, I could make a highway over here, but this may not work, So, but I'm gonna keep this thing in mind. So if you don't know the highway, um, this is like my idea I took from Tropico 4 when I was playing that game. 
Uh, the Howl is basically making two roads, two like uh, rows of road next to each other. And that acts as an actual like highway in the game because you don't have like an actual highway highway in Tropical. So you, you, you get the idea. And can I actually sell something? Let's see. Import? No, I want two coconuts. Any money is good, I guess. I'm not gonna fucking complain and all about that thing. And speaking of complaining, okay, you guys not building the stuff. Right, you've built some of this. Now, change this thing to this. And I'm gonna explain you in a minute why I'm actually exactly picking this thing, this this work mode. Simply because, the fit, if you have noticed, the fertility of the ground under the farms will get destroyed sooner or later. So the idea is that you need to prevent that thing from happening. And you do that by changing the work mode. One, two, three. Okay, that should be enough for now. You change you like avoid that by changing changing the work mode. So we have the multiculture over here. It increases the infertility by 60%. The plantation does not decrease the fertility over time. The plantation gets 20% efficiency for other plantations in the vicinity. So the idea is that I get this thing. Fertility minus 12. Shit. This is just temporary. Like, the idea is that I'm gonna move the plantations later on as the game will progress. What's this? Ooh. Fancy. Cannot wait to get my hands on that thing. Really? Okay. So, yeah, uh, later on we're gonna move like the plantations to a different spot, hopefully, with better fertility. I don't know. We're gonna see. For now, I can only pray and hope that the fertility would fix itself. On its own. Would it work? No idea. No bloody idea. So pray and spray, guys. Pray and spray. No, oh, no. Fire is rising in tropical. Ah, shit, boy. Okay, we need to build the firehouse, uh, firefighter house building, whatever. Can I actually build that thing? Dungeon, prison? What is the thing? It should be in the government. Messy? No. Maybe it's in the public service? Yeah, there it is, fire station. And I don't have money to build it! Yay! Which building is actually burning? Oh, the shack! Oh, thank god! <laughs> More luck! More luck than brains! Honestly, okay. So, the port at the moment is making me 10,000. I am 12,000 on the debt. Okay, that's not good. Loyal Penultimo is speechless. Only oh. the political majesty of his beloved Presidente still spend all the most time. Oh yeah, because I've built the clinic and the clinic actually like affected the the two like housing districts that I had. So thankfully the people are now a little bit more healthy. Since the colonial era, you cannot actually like build, um, let's say, you cannot build like anything related to health. You could just like change maybe the work mode of the church to increase a little bit the health, but in the long run, it's not exactly gonna help you, so... <laughs> Thankfully, we got the clinics, we're gonna build the fire heart, uh, firefighter house over here. And, like, the two most important threats at the moment of Tropical should be dealt with. The two out of three. The first one is starvation, so... You get the idea! Nobody's gonna starve in Tropical. If they're gonna start to starve, I'm gonna feed them with pineapples. And you have a bunch of them, and coconuts. So, speaking of coconuts, is this thing even working? It is, but it has very li little amount of people living in it. Hmm, not good. Okay, work mode of this thing needs to get changed. Take and give, please. Make sure that you're actually planting trees. You morons! Not like this one. He destroyed half of the forest and now we don't have anything around to grow. So that's nice. Uh, okay, money is not gonna be growing for a long time. Okay, we need to do something with the happiness because voting will start soon and I'm completely unprepared for that. So the capitalist doesn't like me and the religious doesn't like me. Why? Food for the people. Okay, that's like an idea. Let's turn off this edict. I want to turn it off. How can I turn it off? Not enough money. I want to turn it off. <laughs> I need to have money to turn this thing off. Ah, shit, that's bad, it's really, really bad, okay, so what else actually annoys you, politics, let's see, faction leader, minus four, okay, we need to bribe him, um, 
Okay, capitalistic edict modifications. Yeah, we need to turn off the edict. Like this edict. But I can't. Because apparently, I need to pay. What is this stupidity? Or oh, I'm doing something wrong. Wait, what? No. Can't be. Can't be doing something wrong with that thing. It has to be that thing. Shit! Oh no! It seems that they want the choice in how they are ruled. So selfish. These speeches are back! I can't believe it! These speeches are back in Tropical since Tropical 4! Okay, so if you have been playing only Tropical 5, you probably are not aware of this thing, but back in. Uh, I'm starting in 3 and 4. I don't know about 1, 2. Uh, there were speeches. So basically, with the speeches, you could. Uh, promise something to the people and this will actually give you like a like a bonus when it comes to voting so for example we know that there are some issues around the island we try to ad address it so fun is up until issue so okay that's nice we can price one of the fractions to get additional bonus so for example we can tr try to price the capitalists we could try to blame somebody so that would decrease the reputation with that fraction but increases with the other so Let's uh, blame the access for the things. And this is like the biggest bonus, because you could try to promise something and the people will be happy because of that, but also you get additional bonus if you're gonna fulfill that promise. But that's like the other side of the coin. If you won't be able to fulfill the promise, then the people will get super angry on you. So sometimes it's good not to promise anything. And you deliver the speech and you pray that you'll be able to win. My friends. You are the dedicated ones for whom no hardship is too great. <laughs> He's actually Go making this speech. Your tribulations shall be rewarded with just a little more effort. <laughs> That's so nice. My people, <laughs> are you bored? Let Presidente entertain you. Oh, it's nothing fun anymore. Let Presidente be all the fun you need. <laughs> you don't enjoy life? Let Presidente enjoy it for you. <laughs> oh. Our ongoing prosperity is supported by the capitalists. With thanks. We're grateful for the many fulfilling jobs you create for my people. And your progressive attitudes towards taxation. <laughs> Just as we praise our friends. That's nice. So we condemn our enemy. Okay, so he's gonna finish the speech very soon. And as I can see, my... Reputation with the citizens have like just skyrocketed because of the speech, so that's like the idea. Okay, pause the game. Oh, it's gonna be hard. It's gonna be really hard to get out of this mess. Okay, let's hope for this. Okay, I could try to build this one. Uh, I'm gonna build you like somewhere here. And that should increase the, uh, the happiness of the people. The thing is, we need to struggle a little tiny bit. To get out of the mess with the money. The idea for today is that I want to set up the steel production, the weapon production, and with that thing, I should technically be able to get back on the track with money. I hope. It's hard to say with this thing actually like work, so. Pray and spray, guys. Pray and spray. And we've won! Kind, not the kind that accidentally reduces the size of the workforce. Great, have some. <laughs> Woo, that was close. So now we can. Aha, so this is the point where we can change, I think, the constitution. Yeah. So all people can vote. Right. And military. Okay, nothing else I could try to do over here. And this thing is not working. We have science. So leave it as it is. Don't, don't touch the constitution for now. Okay. They what the broken me. ones? Do any of these offers look good to you? They're all strange. Yeah, whatever. Legitimate. Shut up, dude. Like, I not fucking need you anyway. I need money. So. As a broker trying to find a way for us to get money. If not, then just have to shoot you. Medium rebel threat. Ay 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 ay. Comprende. Not gonna fucking work. This is bad. I got myself in such a great trouble. I don't know how to get out of it. And it really, really starts to scare me. Okay, we're gonna make like a little bit of money because of the cloth production. Thank God I started to build this thing in a previous episode. That's gonna fucking work. But still, this is not enough. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, 20,000. Let's see how much stuff we have over here to deliver. Right, we have a little bit of stuff. 
Okay. Pause the game. I need to get myself a team master's office. So that we'll be able to deliver the goods around a little bit faster. Okay. So that works. Now, can I please get the steel? Where is it? There it is. I need 9,000 to get this thing. And with the steel, I hope to actually like trade something out. And maybe, just maybe, I'll be able to get a little bit of money. Okay, we can try to actually get this thing as well. So, this thing. No, wait. Wrong, 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 wrong thing. This thing, 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 this thing. So, the treasure hunts actually like make you the right points. So, you can like, you know, keep rolling with the rights of the pirates. Oh, pray and spray, guys. Pray and spray. Okay, we are back on the plus. <laughs> 400. That's not gonna help, but the plus is a plus. So now, steel factory, steel mill, whatever. Uh, okay, what I can try to build? Let's build you here, actually. Wait, I just need to check where are the resources. Okay, there and there. Alright, that should help. So, steel mill, it goes. We go over here. Right, we go bankrupt again. Don't worry, we got this. Don't you just love watching Export the boats. boats. Harbor, President. What? can make boats? Shipyard. Oh. Oh, okay. So I could try to actually get the planks to good use. That's not a bad idea, if you think about that. All right, we're gonna try to do the boat thing as well, very soon. I just need to get a little bit more of money. Right, but struggle is real. But we got this. It's gonna take some time, but I'll be able to get out of the problem. The thing is that I neglected the fertility thingy. And now my farms are like on minus 12. That's like, okay, but this one is, I think... No, this one is minus 12. This one is, I think, minus 12? No, this one is minus 20. This one over here. So, fertility... Yeah. That shocked me like a wrecking ball. And now it haunts me back. Which is not good. Okay, so finally, it's gonna be probably like a good, good uh, time skip. I'm gonna make twenty-five thousand. There you go. We are on the plus. So, woo! Shipyard. Let's make like a shipyard. Think. We're gonna sell boats because of this. So now I can accept the quest from the broker. So he's gonna give us some cash to the Swedish account. So that's gonna be nice. Uh, other thing we could try to do is we could try to build the tannery. But I also need to get people, I need to get like citizens, worker, workforce. So, where is the... That should be in the government thingy. Where is this thing? Immigration center. Okay, if I'm gonna buy this. Okay, I can afford it. Thank God. Oh, it's going completely not in the order I wanted things to go. But okay, hopefully, as long as I stay in the chair, <laughs> let's put it this way. As long as I win the elections, I'm fine. I can struggle. That's not an issue. Because sooner or later, we're gonna actually like, overcome the problem. But if I'm gonna lose the election, that's gonna be the problem. That's gonna be the serious, serious issue. So, um, you know what? Actually, wait. I'm running the dependent. Uh, starting increases the approval of citizens living in the vicinity. What's the problem of you guys? Oh, wait. I remember. The edicts. I still didn't turn off the edicts. That's why you have so much fucking problems around. Okay, so as soon as I get a new money boost, I'm gonna turn off the the bad addicts, the one that are currently not helping me, and hopefully this thing will progress <laughs> one way or another. <laughs> ah, shit. How, how could I screwed up so badly? It's just beyond me. Somehow I've managed. What? How? No idea. Really? Really? No bloody ass idea. This is a little bit stupid that you need to actually have money to turn off the addict, but okay, whatever. Food for the people, turn it off. Uh, siesta, turn it off. Because this is not helping. This is actually like, very not helping. Okay, run the game. Almanac. Now let's see happiness. Uh, the politics. Okay, ta capitalistic. They should start to like me now, because I turned off the food for the people one. And they really don't like that one. Religious, what do you like? Faction leader, minus four. Okay, who's the faction leader? I cannot select you. Is because I tried to kill you or something? <laughs> I don't recall killing anybody yet. 
So that's like quite interesting. Okay, 11,000 is going good. It's going good. 19,000, this is what I like to see. Bo boats. <gasps> We're selling the boats. Finally, the boats are getting sold. Oh my god. We are making boats. I'm sure yep. the good citizens no, 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 no. No need to, to you, help the citizens <laughs> choose the right one. Okay, 20,000. That's what I like to see. So we're gonna be on plus 8,000. There you go. Sweet. Now, this is where the magic comes. Because I could try to build the mines in order to get the steel mill working. But I could also try to do something else. And if this thing will work, I'm gonna technically make like really good amount of money so we need to make like a license but first i need to like get rid of the existing ones yes yeah, so we need to sell coconuts and sugar a lot more for some no reason to me i'm not selling the coconuts the way i want to sell them so we need one more coconut harvester build it somewhere and try to get rid of that stupid ass stupid <laughs> transactions I decided to pick because yeah what's the possibly was that could happen if you're gonna try to uh, cancel your deal with the alliance or with the access so I don't know they could try to raid your island for example so that's something we don't want to occur okay Woo, we're getting we're going back on the plus 20,000 thank god finally okay are we getting any like actually tropicans open doors yeah we should get like more people Let's see how the farms are working. Full? Almost full? Not full? Not full, not full. Okay, so now still comes the problem with workforce. Hmm. I need to force... I mean, I need to invite more people to the island. Not exactly sure how I'm gonna do that thing. So let's maybe try to make some more public service. Some more entertainment thingies. And maybe that's actually gonna help. So maybe how about this thing? Can I build it here over here? No, I have to build it on the shore. Okay, game. There you go. Build it over there. I don't care. As long as you make the people happy, I'm fine with it. So, do whatever you have to do. Just make the people happy. So, I'll be able to actually, like, progress in this episode. <laughs> because right now, <laughs> let's be honest, we haven't progressed an inch. We're just standing in place and trying to breathe. And it's barely working. Also, I'm not sending enough boats. Why am I selling so little boats? God damn it, game. What the fuck? Okay, sugar. It's not getting sold. Ay, ay, ay. Nobody fucking told me that the stupid fair pair is gonna require bloody electricity. God damn it. So now we're like probably like wondering uh, where I'm gonna put the steel mill into, into good use and what about weaponry? I should already build the mines. The thing is, at some point in the game, the mines can actually like run out dry so i want before i'm gonna try to build the mines because that's gonna be easy i want to try to do actually like trading so you go into and you actually import the things because you're probably like wondering why the shit you have the import option that's why so i'm gonna try to import coal and that's gonna be like 2000 and it's gonna be it's gonna cost me three thousand per 100 right per 1000 so you get the idea that's like quite a lot so that's coal, and now we need to get iron as well. Import iron. Okay. So I get those two things. Uh, I need to make like a team instead over here as well. So what is the thing that it is? Actually build it closer to the housings. Just in case. There we go. Now, the idea is that the ship will come over here. He's gonna drop coal and iron. The truck will come. It's gonna deliver the goods over here. Let's actually open it for workers to work. It's gonna deliver the things over here. And they're gonna turn that thing into steel, okay? So, I should be able to make a little bit of profit. But to make a full profit out of that thing, I need the weaponry. How exactly is that gonna work? <laughs> You're gonna see me very soon. Okay, so my coal and iron has arrived. Uh, I paid how much in total for this? Let's see. Coal. I've paid 3,000. And for the iron, I paid 3,000. So, that's like... Actually, I paid 7,000 in total, more or less. 7,000 per 100, per 7,000 per 1,000 of resources each, right? Well, okay, whatever. <laughs> I'm gonna shut up, you get the idea. So, now, the resources come to the steel mill, and now they're gonna turn that thing into normal steel. 
Okay, and with that steel, I hope to make even more money. But to make real money, we need to get the weapon factory. And now I need to get a little bit of cash again to build that thing. And if I'm gonna get the proper deal, which I don't see. There it is, the smugglers. This one, uh, that was the one, that was the one I was looking for. So, you sell 1,000 uh, weapons to the smugglers and they pay you 30,000. So, even though that I'm paying a lot of money for the resources, I get shitloads of money back from the smugglers. So, as long as I have those trade deals up, I'm making a profit. I'm making actually like a huge profit. So, I need to buy a... Uh, okay, we have to like get rid of one of those. Uh, okay, let's get it over this one and I'm gonna block this one from disappearing this one just just to make sure that this one won't disappear from me So now we only need to build the weapon factory and we'll be set Tropical we finally become the financial capital of the world cannot wait for that thing to happen Okay, the trade ship Is not sold anything what? Oh, because the game actually acknowledged uh, the iron and the coal that I have as something I could try to sell. And I'm not selling that thing, I'm buying that thing, so... Yeah... Struggle is real over here. The struggle is real. The idea is that I cannot allow them to sell the steel. So I need to w set up the weapon factory as soon as possible. Come on, guys! Sell me this crap! So I'll be able to afford the weapon factory. I know you won't want to be armed to the thief. But first we have to sell the weapons to the nations at war. And then we're gonna see. Still cannot afford it. God damn it game. Okay, the freighter is arriving. Should be able to afford it now. Pause the game. I cannot afford it. Why the weapon factory costs so much? Aich. Ay 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 Okay, hope for the best man. I don't think we're selling steel here. I don't see steel. I think all of the steel is actually like gathered over here. So as long as they won't try to export it, I should be fine. Tobacco, cotton, corn, coffee, rum, iron. Okay, that's why 12,000. Expect for the iron. Fire is rising. Shit, again? Okay, thankfully the fire department, even though it's like far away, like this is the range technically, but still they're gonna travel here. If they should, at least. Where are they? Guys, start to work. <laughs> Excuse me, where's the fire department? Um, the building is kind of like, you know. Oh, wait, somebody's coming. There it is. Oh, thank God. Woo, that was close. Okay. Nothing out of the order. Now we just have to get a little bit of money to build the weapon factory. If a freight is gonna arrive, technically I should make 25,000, so that should be more than enough to build me this stupid ass war factory. Weapon factory, war factory. You get the idea. Oh! Come on! Come on! Come on. As soon as I'm gonna get it, like huge money. There you go. Pause the game. Weapon factory. Oh, yes. It's happening, guys! It's happening! There you go. The thing is, we need to set up one more deal. And we need to buy nickel, if I can only find it. This thing. Import. So, three, three, and six, right? So that's around 10,000. Yeah, around 10,000 uh, per resources. But, I'm selling this, and I'm making 30,000. You get the idea. <laughs> Money. I just made... Money! Delivery of weapon have been just sent from the uh, from the factory and I think this is this loading over here. This truck. Let's see... No! Weapon's already in. So... If I'm gonna sell this... I'm gonna make 37,000. <laughs> this is how you make money, guys. This is how you make the cash. So bad you're not sending the stupid st steel... from next fucking door. Okay. So as soon as I'm gonna get the money, I think it's actually time to uh, build some bus stoppers. Oh my god. 51,000 in cash. Hell yes! 55,000. Oh yes, keep it coming, keep it coming. This will have like one month before the ship is actually gonna arrive. Come on, make it 60. 
60. 60. 57. Come on. 61,000. We've broke the bank, guys. <laughs> I am good at this game. El Presidente is back. It's time, guys. We have the money. We have the technology. It's so time to build the lovely apartments. Time to build a proper housing area. And I think I'm going to build a housing area over here, like on this plateau. I think this is actually gonna be a good idea unless you have something unique when it comes to plantations let's see okay cotton cotton can where's okay cotton can be over here coffee coffee is like on the middle one pineapples on the middle one mostly banana middle one tobacco middle one coca down here and here sugar well here too bad i screwed up with the fertility you know can I actually like make the farms in a different place as well? Ah, shit. I did not know it's gonna hit me so bad. Ah, oh, fudge. Okay, well, there's a little, a little bit of farming space over here, so maybe later on I'll be able to build some farms over here. But this, this place, I think, is a safe bet. Cotton is like too small. Coca is a little tiny bit. Yeah, but I have coca over here and here. So I think this should be like alright to, to build like a housing area over here. So without further ado, apartments, ladies and gentlemen. Just how I'm gonna exactly build you. How about this? Yeah, this this should actually be okay. So uh free. Let's make something like this. And I'm gonna now surround you with some nice sexy plazas. So you're gonna all enjoy living in this area, so nobody's gonna complain. That something is wrong here, that you are smelling or whatever, I think. And uh, this thing... Okay, I need to build one more and, like, rotate it. Oh, they already rotated it for me. <laughs> How lovely! The game knows what I want to do. I uh, need a statue one? Oh, you don't have the statue one. Oh, that's a pity. Okay. That's one thing. And now I could actually try to build, let's say, the church. Oh, yeah. Mm-mm-mm. Now, this is what I like to see. Hell to the yes, next to the weapon factory. <laughs> Bless be the bullets and these weapons, so they will fly to our enemies. <laughs> Something like that. And I also need to build the grocery store, and I need to build it on the road. The fucking lifeful. But hey, after a little bit of struggle, finally, I've got to build the new stuff. Uh, the thing is, I've noticed that the steel mill is not working as full uh, efficiency because I'm lacking like education. So, high school is finally in order. Education is starting to spread among Tropicans as soon as our president actually decided to do something instead of just sitting on his ass. Okay, right, we got this. More or less, we got this. So, I still have like resources over here. I'm not exactly sure how I'm gonna solve this issue, but I figured out how to make bridges. Because I have thought that you need to actually have like a like a building for that. No, you just click the button, you just go around and there you go, you build a bridge. So, the question is, should we try to use one of the surrounding islands for our own benefit? Is there like actually an island who can fulfill all of our needs? I think I screwed up like the best island to actually like do the farming, apparently. I think, I'm not sure. So, I have an like, idea, I don't know whether this idea works, but I think that a lot of plantations can be built over here. Coca, okay, coca won't work, will it work over here? Tobacco will work, banana will work, pineapple will work, coffee will work, cotton will work, rubber works. So everything works here, mostly, expect for... for coca over here yeah because I screwed up the fertility so I'm searching around for like a good area for a uh, for a for a for a for a new farming district like for a new farming island I think I screwed up this thing way too much I think this plateau over here is actually like quite good yeah it's decent this one over here so this one over here how about this one let's see uh, okay, works, 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 also works. Yeah, that's also like an idea. So, I could try to make like a housing district on this side, make a farming over here, 
and they and they make like an industrial area over here with with uh, weapon factories and stuff like that. So we have to move all of the uh, all of the like housing districts, all of the houses up here to the mountains. Always a pleasure. Oh, okay, thanks. That's like not a bad idea if you think about that. I'm still like making money, so that's okay. Anything else I could try to sell around? Oh, I need to make the cigars, I think. I'm making... Uh, I don't think I'm making cigars. could try to sell them. I am selling them, but I'm not making any, so... That's like another industrial building we have to build somewhere around here. Let's see, cigars... Cigar factory, yeah. Definitely don't have it. Okay. <laughs> hey, look at that! Went bankrupt again. That's a surprise. God damn it, game. Okay, so now the situation is like a little bit more stable. Sorry if there's gonna be like a lot of cuts, but basically like I needed to cut a lot, probably. Uh, well, to cut a lot. The thing is that I was just sitting here for the most of the part and waiting for the buildings to trigger the things, for the money to actually like flow in. Now the money is like steady flowing in. Uh, I'm still like work lacking of workforce, so as soon as those buildings are gonna get filled with, with work, workforce uh, because of the school that I have built over here then this should be like a little bit easier because we have like a... Uh, the, the production will keep going not like this, like there's only one guy so yeah, he's not exactly working like around the clock so that also takes some time uh, our happiness with the citizens steady and slowly grows so that's also quite nice anything else? I don't think so Slowly and steady, I need to like move all of the citizens from here up here. So, uh, in the next episode, we're gonna probably try to expand this uh, housing area a little bit more. We're gonna continue the road here, and then we're gonna try to build some actual like factories over here and build like a pro proper port area, proper like other things. And after that, I think we're gonna try to consider maybe moving to a new island, maybe on this one actually. Like, if there's something interesting here. Oh wait, I just think I screwed up something. No, almost. <laughs> uh, did I? Yeah, I just... Fuck, I forgot about this. God damn it, and I have to wreck this thing as well. Oh well, this is what happens when you don't pay attention to things that are happening around you. God damn it. <laughs> just wasted a bunch of money. Good job, yo. You did it again. I know, I know, guys. I know. Motherfucker. God damn Damn it, piece of shit. Rap, fuck. Ugh, so annoyed. So annoyed because of this. Okay, you know what? I think this is actually a good point to cut this episode over here before I'm gonna go completely crazy and screw up something even more. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you liked the episode, please subscribe a lot. I'll see you all in the next video.